Hello my darlings and welcome to my channel. Today we're gonna have a coffee cup reading about May events or any month that you're watching but uh, because May is coming uh, we're gonna look at that. You may choose from those two cups pile one or pile two and we will start with pile number one. Hello pile one, whoever chose this cup, let's see your events of the month, May events, wow you have something, so many interesting things here, mm -hmm. I didn't look at your cup yet, I just made it recently, uh, and look at this, um, wow, <laughs> do you see what I see, one second, uh, I see a person with a very big beard, white beard, like a Santa Claus. He also smokes something here. <laughs> uh, also he has something on his shoulder, like uh, animal helpers here. Why do I feel like either this is your uh, angel guide or your, uh, uh, what's the name of it? <clears throat> It could be your higher self, it could be some some wise man as an energy, as a, an angel that is helping you here. Also, he has few animals here sitting on his shoulders. Wow, this is crazy. And I want to say he brings you a very positive news. Uh, I just heard for some news of abundance or news of for some of the news of a child, news of um, some good news that you're waiting on maybe. Let me ask that. This is this is a very beautiful image here that I see. What kind of news? Definitely news. Um, how are they gonna make it? Wow! Wow! I'll tell you two possibilities. The only thing I want to tell you for sure is that those news will bring you definitely good clarity and what to do next, where to go next, how to um, how to lead next. So for some, something that currently very bothering you, like you may be struggling with something, maybe you have sleepless nights right now about something. You're overwhelmed, you don't know exactly what's going on, you're confused. All this confusion is um, ending with those news. And for some you're waiting for quite some time and you don't know what to expect good or bad news you don't know how it will go some result or some expectations of yours they have two sides in your head like either it will go bad very bad or very good um, confusion lots of confusion will be resolved if you don't have any confusion currently it may happen in may or whichever month you're watching and i have 11 11 on my clock i just looked at my phone <coughs> something will finally be aligned into place I hear and that's why this wise man is bringing you those news what else could it be okay for others it could be news about your um, moving relocation house news about a child as i said or maybe your uh, child that you already have um, about a family for some it's news about a certain woman queen of wands for most of you it will be very good news for you could even be about your love life here Again, for others of you, you will realize something about your love life 
uh, that will give you understanding or where or how to move forward clarity basically uh, this wise man brings you clarity pile one <coughs> which is overall good news you'll find out what you want to find out basically what else I also see a dog here, like a face of a dog. Maybe with white hair, maybe you have a dog as a confirmation to you. But for others, it's some friend that is around you or will be. Maybe you'll, you'll meet a new person that's going to be your long time loyal friend. I have a big bear here or teddy bear that gives you a hand maybe expect a certain gift or a present from somebody you care for you love um, yeah some positive positive gifts or presents why am I saying positive? Because sometimes we get presents from people we don't care or uh, it's not that valuable to us or it's not that seen. You're going to be feeling that one. An emotional level. I see some of you will be jumping um, happy like that, you know, doing your hands like that because somebody will get accepted somewhere or to a new job. The offer that's coming to you will make you happy. What is this about? Why you will be jumping around uh, in a way, smiling, laughing? Uh, a certain war will end with maybe a person or an argument or you're going to win an argument uh, or you're going to win a court. I don't know. Something about... Something will end for you in your favor here, pile number uh, one. For some of you, you'll get your property. I don't know why I want to say it that way. You'll get your property or you'll get your property back or you'll get your property sold. So you're getting rid of some uh, burden here or something that less didn't end. And it's, it's going to be celebrated. That's why you're going to celebrate maybe even with your family or maybe by yourself for some of you you're not gonna tell anyone that you kinda um, you did something or something has finished for good ended for good if you're signing some paperwork or you I don't know maybe getting a divorce or uh, you waiting for the paperwork or you um, fighting with someone for something you will uh, get what you need hmm. or a job as I said maybe a job offer could also be doesn't have to go that you know deep I see a woman here tall woman uh, with a funny hair I want to say for some reason or something maybe about her eyes one could be a bit bigger or and one is a bit closer I feel like this is your um, I don't know why I want to say godmother or you know in this um, um, in a fairy tale Cinderella right there is a godmother she's coming uh, to help her I feel like some um, fairy godmother your guide it's a feminine energy is coming to help you in a certain moment of time she's guiding you with something she's telling you something or maybe you'll have, you'll have a dream about some woman I hear she's coming at the right timing or she will lead you towards the 
it's like you will be end up in the right time at the right place and she will be guiding you for some reason what about it very mysterious reading for pile one you have many guides here that are helping you just you know thank them because yeah a woman and look here she's also tall uh, and even similar in some way but here she's alive there she's not alive either she's a ghost or she's a, not a ghost but like she's in your vision maybe deceased one somebody who you know was a, was a woman but she's on your side right She will make you to uh, wow pile number uh, one she will make you to to she will help you to make a sudden decision I, imagine that just an example but you have to understand the vibe of it uh, imagine you are going somewhere or driving somewhere just for you know everyday things or you doing you at work you doing something and suddenly something comes up and you only have two five two three minutes to decide like you don't have much time or you don't feel like you have to give it that much time you just quickly respond or you quickly um, react some some of your reaction will surprise even you you will even surprise yourself and this woman uh, this guide will it's like she's gonna be your hand she's gonna be your voice she's gonna be your um, she's gonna be you at this those seconds to say what needs to be said for instance you in a normal uh, day you would say no to someone and suddenly you say yes and then you turn around like what did I just why did I say yes who made me saying these things or for instance you are a very honest person and somebody will come and ask you something and suddenly you start lying to them and you're like why am I saying those things because this is need this will be needed at the moment maybe so nobody knows a certain information so she will actually do things for you it's going to be quick seconds but you would wouldn't understand why it happened you will understand later on that it wasn't really you and you may even say what got into me well your guide got into you to say it the way it needs to be said at the moment because eventually it brings you to the right place or it brings you to the right energy or the circumstances will turn to will, will turn to your into your favor going from there from that decision from that word from that sentence wow this is so powerful this is so powerful pile one i didn't know this reading overall will be that uh, magical here I thought it's just May events but here it's more than that do you see this tower here and the tower over here um, it seems like a good tower pile number one also seems like a tree growing for some of you you will be uh, working in an environment where there's like high-rise buildings or you are currently and things will be happening mostly in May or in the month that you're watching uh, in this building, in this office, in this tower. Um, for others of you, you will be building a foundation or start a foundation to create your own um, empire, tower, a tree, a house tree or um, home, whatever it means to you in all different kinds of ways. What is this tower about? Card just fell, just a second. 
two cards fell. Two cards fell. Uh, Ace of Cups and Page of Swords. Definitely a creation of something that will require your uh, mental attention. It's like you re decided. For instance, you decided that you want to grow your business. And the strategy that you will be using will be coming from your uh, positive look at this situation. If it's a job that you just got or you're getting or you want to raise, your strategy will be out of love and the, the tower will be taller. The, the, uh, you will expand whatever you want to expand. If this is a love life or a relationship that you're currently in, with this strategy that you will take, it will grow into something solid, into something uh, confident, stable. Uh, some strategy here of yours will be the main uh, the main the main reason this tower is growing basically. Yes, for many of you it's about love or partnership. Uh, so basically you will be ride, riding in a new direction here when it comes to your connections, relationships, partnerships, business ideas and so forth. Maybe even literal traveling. So the strategy that you take and will give you the result in a much faster way. Hmm. Uh, so what will be the recommendation here, pile one? Change your strategy, maybe. If something doesn't work now, change your strategy. Uh, in the long run, strategy is not something that you just did once or out of your fear or out of your excitement. This is something you, from time to time, you continuously doing, right? But if you are doing something and it, you see it's, it's working, uh, not working in the moment, but working throughout the time. Like maybe if you look like five, six months before now and you see things are growing, things are changing, uh, and uh, that means your strategy is working. If you see everything falling apart, because the tower could also mean things are falling apart for you and you need a new strategy that will have a you know more solid foundation to it. So look at your life at least six months before now and see which strategy of yours, which attitude of yours works better or works the best and continue following it. I want to end this reading here for some reason. I feel like that's all the messages that you needed to hear. Thank you very much, pile number one. That was very strong. And I'm going for pile two. Well, hello, Pao Tzu, whoever chose this cup. Let's look at your May events or any month that you're watching. So, what you need to know about your month of May. Look at this. Someone is building a road towards you. This is hidden. Pile number two. Someone is secretly building a path towards you. They doing it on a secret. What is this about? <laughs> Let's see. Someone is secretly uh, trying to find uh, the right way to. I don't know if it's to your heart, to your wisdom, to uh, to you in general. Someone is building 
little yeah, oh my god i just wanted to say why does this remind me all this you know tricky ways of this card of the seven of swords in this specific deck so you don't see um that someone behind the scenes is building a path towards you but this is not a bad path this is with the star it's um, their intentions are not bad but they're i mean sometimes the intentions are not bad but maybe they are bad for you or you don't want them i don't know uh who is this person let's ask that Someone is, wow, somebody may be secretly in love with you here. Or they want your energy or they want to be like you. Let me, let me ask that because it's general reading. Very secretive vibe. Very secretive vibe. I'm so sorry. Uh, true by the way this this uh, hidden situation will come out it's like a sneeze you cannot really control it right um, who is this person that building a road towards you secretly mm -hmm. a white bear <laughs> the devil <laughs> Okay, interesting news. Pile 2, okay. This is so different from Pile 1. Even if you watch them both, it's just a different energy and different information. So somebody here is obsessed with you, right? In any way. They may be obsessed with you literally, physically. They may be obsessed with your um, the way you live. Um, and this obsession is um, making them to make a certain steps, maybe secretly watching you somewhere, um, keeping an eye on you, spying on you. Um, you not when you will find out about it, and you will, some way, some reason, you will find out about this. For some, it may be physically you will find out. For others, you may suddenly have an insight or a dream that they are doing this or some um, signs from the universe that this person is doing some. You know this person some way, right? You maybe even have uh, also have feelings for them or had before or uh, you work with them. I don't know what's going on here. So... <clears throat> You're not going to be happy about what they're doing, right? There may be even eventually be a certain argument or um, sharp words said that like, why would you do this? Why would you follow me? Why would you do this or that? But funny, what's funny here is that all this argument, all those disagreements, all this rejection of yours of what they're doing or, uh, you know, eventually will end with the Ten of Cups. So either you will, they will tell you how they feel or they will explain their way and you eventually either will forgive them or there could be even um, happy happy ending of a story. So some madness, some anger, some... <laughs> some strange behavior will end up good and that's why i'm saying i don't feel very negative about this but at first it will like make you maybe because you don't know everything it make it will make you be angry or concerned 
not even angry, concerned why this person is making all those steps. Why are they doing this or that? Maybe it's your partner and their... Uh, listen, simple example. Maybe it's your partner or somebody you with or somebody you're in love with. Uh, they secretly check in your phone or who's calling you. Maybe there is some jealousy issues here going on. But eventually you will resolve them. This is the simplest example that I can give. Okay, let's uh, not stop here. Other things to watch, but very interesting. Some of you I see a person stands with a microphone. Maybe some of you will be performing, singing, maybe go to karaoke soon in May or whenever you watch this reading. Or you will be saying some important um, words. Maybe you're going to be at someone else's, um, I just heard a wedding or a party where you will need to say uh, blessings to or like congratulate someone, right? You will be, mainly I feel the energy of performance could be here. Or somebody will say those things to you. Words of wisdom, admiration I hear. Okay, for some of you I see... Um, I see some result. Um, I see a woman petting her, it's not even a pet, it's more of a, you know, in a farm or like people grow animals. So something you've been growing here, metaphorically, right speaking, will give you uh, finally the results. I hear the chicken will finally give you a golden egg out of all these regular eggs uh, you will get this golden egg finally and you uh, will be happy about it for some of you it's your first successful result that you will be able to say oh I made this happen for some it's gonna be a first sale your first sale if you in a retail business or something like that First reward. For some of you, you will be uh, giving gratitude to your um, de deity or somebody who you believe in. I see lots of energy here um, of um, Indian uh, traditions because I see some images of that. Just for some, doesn't have to be. Some of you will be visiting a, a desert, desert, like deserted pl a place or country. I wanna have a little bit more information. This is not just that. By the way, your second half of the month will be more profitable than the first, or like will be more um, successful or more free. And look, I just shuffled the seven of swords, came through again, this energy, and, and ten of pentacles, okay? Some hidden success. For some of you, it's even, uh, yeah, it's unexpected trip that you don't plan. You don't know about this yet. Maybe, oh, oh my God, did I spoil it for someone? Maybe your person is planning uh, why all those steps. For some planning a trip for you, maybe they buying tickets and you're not even aware of this and maybe you'll go somewhere like, I don't know, somewhere in the desert or Middle East I hear or 
some places where there is um, more sand or more dryness maybe to the west I don't know depends where you live yeah there could be some hidden tree that's coming and you're not aware of it yeah you may be upset with someone but they actually behind the scenes preparing something for you Oh my god, you're gonna love this. I don't wanna ruin the surprise if it's a surprise. If it's not, you're just gonna find out some uh, something good out of what you thought is bad or what you thought is wrong. That's that's the main energy here. Yes, and you will be happy eventually. Somebody will be visiting a certain lake house. Um, a quiet, very quiet place. Maybe it's your parents' place. Maybe it's... Um, somewhere where, like in a forest or next to the lake. You will be visiting some quiet place to calm your um, mind. To meditate maybe. To get your... You know energy together whatever burdens you right now and you think it's a burden it's actually your freedom uh, whatever it means to you uh, pile number one eventually you realize that it wasn't even uh, or like you worrying about something but it wasn't it's not that it's a waste of time even when we worry it's our lessons we go through we um, we grow still spiritually right but something that you're worrying about is nothing that you should be worrying about that's what i hear otherwise that's what i had for you today guys i love you all and i'll see you soon bye bye